Go Generation One! Well, the reality is that uh, tertiary education is the answer. If Indigenous people uh, feel the need to, to continue their education, uh, it opens the doors to a whole host of opportunities that uh, perhaps our mums and our dads never had opportunities to take advantage of. And I believe as young people, uh, it's, it's, and, and with the new generation, Generation One, the, the onus is on us now because the opportunity has been given to us to, uh, to step through the door, embrace the opportunity with both hands and run with it, you know, run with it because, because we can do it, we can do it, we can achieve and uh, the success is, is, is within grasp. You know, we can and we are a part of the mainstream without losing any of our Indigenous culture or our, our own identity, you know. And uh, we can all do it. And that's the truth. <laughs> Not just me, anyone. <laughs>very important for young people who are growing older to, to still re retain that language and that cultural knowledge. Um, I think if we don't do it now then it's, we're going to, 20 years down the track, we're going to end up in a very tricky situation where we won't have any self-identity or any self-knowledge about where we come from or where we're going. Yeah, so um, I work at the Loft Youth Arts and Cultural Centre. Um, we're a drug and alcohol free venue for the young people of Newcastle. Uh, we have a very huge following of young kids. Um, it's not a huge number of Indigenous people, but we're working on changing that. So yeah, if any young kids out there in the Newcastle area are keen to do anything through the arts, anything through culture, then please come in, check us out at the loft, and we'll see if we can get you heading in the right direction. Go Generation 1 from Newcastle!